you so much for always watching my channel. Today I will be speaking of sleep hygiene. Yes. As we all know that this channel talks more about heart health, nursing and nursing care. And um, sleep is one of the most important parts, okay, in our total health. Most especially in cardiovascular health. So, how do we maintain a good sleep hygiene? How do we do that? Have um, like seven tips on how to maintain a good sleeping hygiene. So let's go. Okay, my number one here is um, keep a consistent sleep schedule. Have a particular time you normally go to bed. Okay, make sure you tidy up your work before that particular time. For example, if I love going to bed at 6 p.m., I will have done all my jobs, all my daily activities, you know, eat my dinner and go straight to bed. So make sure you have a consistent sleeping schedule. You know that you sleep by 8 p.m. today, you are going to sleep by 9 p.m. tomorrow, you can sleep by 12 a.m. in the morning. You know. This will help you to maintain that particular time of the day. And also avoid daytime naps, especially people that have issues with sleeping at night, insomnia. So we encourage you to try and avoid sleeping in the day so that you have um, a good rhythm, okay? Sleeping without the night, you need to sleep very well in the night. So go to bed early enough, okay? So you target at least seven hours of sleep. Target at least seven hours of sleep, okay? So if, like I said before, no particular time you go to bed, it will really help you and make sure you go early to enable you to achieve at least seven hours, which will help your general health. Engage in the relaxing activities, okay? Such as have a warm bath before going to bed. You can pick your Bible or pick some of the nice book to read before you know, going to bed. That will also help you to calm down and it will be refreshing for you. Sleep in a cool, quiet, and a dark room. Not that you come and on your light, the light is on, and you want to sleep, so people cannot sleep with the light on. So I encourage you to what? Hold the light. Make sure your bed is cool. You can find your AC. You can put your fan on. This will enable you to do what? To have a good sleep hygiene. Okay, avoid going to bed with um, brain stimulants, okay, such as uh, caffeine. Okay, so don't drink caffeine. Like four hours to bed is not good. This will, you know, will not make your brain to, you know, to relax. So please stay away from such, such substances. They reduce your fluid intake. Not that when you are going to about to go to bed, you are not taking like four, four pure water. You no, know, you are taking like uh, two bottle water before going to bed. This will make you to stand up and you know, go to the toilet to you know, ease yourself frequently, which will disrupt your sleeping uh, pattern and that will not give you a good sleeping hygiene. So you are encouraged to do what? To sleep. To take um, minimal water in the night. Okay? Then, please avoid taking sleeping pills. Yes, because if you keep taking sleeping pills at the time, your other sleeping pills has um, their effect. Okay? So before you take your sleeping pills, make sure you see your doctor, communicate with your doctor before you can take uh, sleeping pills because it has its own rebrand. So I encourage you to do that. I hope these tips will have helped someone or will help someone to have a good sleeping hygiene. 